Good morning. Welcome to Dude RV. I sure appreciate you stopping by. And of course, you got here just in time. That's right. It is Friday. And that means another edition of Friday's Finds. Man, it is a quiet, quiet morning out here. And it is, it's getting hot. Supposed to be a hundred... 100 plus degrees today. So we're gonna get this done before it gets that hot. I wanna thank Martin for sponsoring this edition of Friday's Finds. Martin and reached out to me and said, yeah, hey, we wanna be on that Friday's Finds show. And so they, are, they have sent me a 20,000 BTU Deluxe Propane Camping Stove. You know, I was looking for one of those when I bought the Blackstone. Or I was looking for one of those when I bought the flat top griddle. So I'm excited about this. Let's let's pull it out of the box and get a good look at it. There we go. How does this box come apart? There's out of the packaging now. You know, the first thing I know is right off the bat, there's there's no feet. So we have two burners, obviously, and a piezoelectric igniter. We'll need that. And I, that's that's interesting because the the last couple of camp stoves that I've had that I've owned everything went down inside. I mean the the burners were exposed. They weren't nice and neat like this. This does operate off of a one pound propane bottle. Here's your little. Regulator. Uh, for those, those days, those times when the wind is blowing, we've got wind baffles, wind shields, wind guards, where you have your your typical one pound bottle connector. So this is where you connect and put that in and you connect that to your one pound propane bottle. Here, let me, let me get a bottle of propane. All set up. Let's give this thing a, a try. You can't see it, but you can hear it. Now we're burning. Now we're cooking. So now that we've got the Martin camp stove set up, we need to cook something. And I think I know the, the best thing to cook since it's morning. Let's, let's cook a bagel. If you're new to the channel, you may not know this, but I have a, an affinity for, I used to have an affinity for McDonald's breakfast bagels, but when COVID hit, they stopped making them. And so I had to 
I had to find, I had to come up with my own breakfast bagel. So we're going to start off with putting a little, uh, the, the bacon is already cooked, but it needs to be cooked a little bit more to kind of crisp it up. We've got scrambled eggs. This one is going to use a little goat cheese. And of course we've got a everything bagel. We're going to be cooking it in the large 12 inch skillet. So let's start cooking. Good angle right there. So we'll start cooking. Cooking on the left burner this morning. I have a flat top. A grill griddle but it's in the camp box and I didn't want to pull that out we'll make do with a skillet this isn't real butter just so you know this is faux butter I like a good camp stove. This this is this is great. I'm enjoying this. And we do have enough room that we can cook with the the 12 inch skillet while the windshield is up. I think our bacon is about done. Now we're going to toast the bacon. Turn that way down before we put some eggs on. Lots of heat. So I guess we're putting out 10,000 BTUs per burner. Since it's a 20,000 BTU stove. I can see many a great camp meal being prepared 
Oh, you guys can't see. There we go. Y'all lost the, the view. Here, let me put that back down. There we go. Now you can see. Ooh, it's still really hot. I think we're about done with the bagel. A little bit more there. Yep. It's a little too hot for the egg. Put the goat cheese in the middle so it'll start melting. This is kind of a soft goat cheese. I don't remember the name of it. That's a big old mess right there. That's okay. It's gonna eat good. I'm not on one of them fancy cooking shows. I'm demonstrating how hot the Martin Camp stove actually gets. I like to get a good crisp on the on the egg. I'm gonna turn that off because we are we're approaching the finish line. I'm gonna go eat my bagel and I'll be back. Oh man, that, that bagel was so good. If, if you're interested in, in seeing, I've, I've got a whole video on making that bagel. It's, uh, I'll put a link 
in the card right up there for you. That's good. Let's talk about the Martin. The Martin Deluxe Propane Stove. 20,000 BTUs. I really like the ease of cleaning. Not having to get down there into the burners and the, and the venturi pipes and all of that. I really like, I like everything about this stove. I think this is a heck of a value. The Martin stove is available on Amazon. And I, I've got a playlist on the, Influ the Dude RV Gear Recommendation Influencer page. And I'll put a link to that right up there and in the description below. If you want to learn more about it, you're more than welcome to go check that out. I, I think it's a great value. It, it's hard to find a good quality camp stove for a reasonable price. And Martin has, has hit that nail on the head. Thank you, Martin, for sponsoring this edition of Friday's Finds. Uh, I hope you guys that are watching will, will pay them the respect of going over and at least looking at it and man, go check it out. You'll, you'll be happy that you did. If this is your first visit to Dude RV, I am most honored that you stuck with me to the end. You don't know how good that bagel was. And it's even better because you guys helped me make it. Thank you for that opportunity. If you've not already, I'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button. And remember, hit that bell as well. That way you'll never miss another episode of the Dude RV Traveling Roadshow. I do this Friday's Finds every Friday, 4 o'clock. Hit the subscribe button. That way you don't miss it. For those of you who have been following along, Thank you. I am most honored. That's why I get to do what I do. I really appreciate that. And for my patrons, you rock. Y'all come back now, you hear?